Hi guys, so today I'm doing a get ready with me and I hope you enjoy. So the primer I'm going to be using is the Hard Candy Sheer MB Coconut Water Primer Stick. And I recently got this and I love this because it's pore minimizing, hydrating, and it's great. So after that, I'm going to be using my Black Beauty Blender and my BB Cream from Maybelline New York. I really like this BB Cream because it it's like dark, but then it fades out to light because it is a tint. So next I'm going to be using this concealer by Rimmel and it is in the shade 335 light medium and I use this to highlight my under eyes. Next I'm going to be using this Airspun loose face powder and I, I'm in honey beige and I bake. So I'm waiting for my bake to set. I'm going to be using the Photo Focus Lash Primer by Wet n Wild and I really suggest this to everyone because I have really short tiny eyelashes and they stick out straight and an eye curler doesn't really help and this is like the one product I can get to where my eyelashes will stay curled all day. So what I've been using a while to kick off my bake is this Tarte powder brush I think it is. But it is wet because I recently washed all my brushes so I'm going to be using my e.l.f. Travel Kabuki brush. And I really like this because it's just easy to carry for my makeup bag. So next, after I did my bake, I'm going to be doing the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Plus Poreless 310 Sun Beige Powder Brush. And I'm going to be using this IT Cosmetics Number 8 Wand Ball Brush. So after using my face powder, I'm going to be using this e.l.f. Under Eye Setting Powder to make sure to get rid of any bags and creases under my eyes. So now that I'm in the section of blushes, I'm going to be talking about all the blushes I own because I use them throughout the cycle. So one of the favorites I am into right now is the e.l.f. Single Blush in Melamauve. So the next set of blushes I want to talk to is this e.l.f. Blush Palette and it's the shade Dark. Now one of these blushes, one of the these pans right here, this one, is not a blush, this is a highlighter. I just did not like the blush. So the last blush I want to talk about is my NARS Z palette, and it is the Tarte Forest Clay 12 Hour Blush. And I don't know what shade it is in, but yeah. So before I decide what blush I want to use, I'm going to show you the brush I use. And this is from It Cosmetics and it is 227 Flawless Blush. So the blush I think I'm going to use is the one that I think is my favorite right now, which is the e.l.f. Single Pan Melon Moth. So I already put it on this blush, but the reason I really like this blush and I've been liking it lately is because it isn't like, I don't like a heavy blush, I like a lighter one. I really like this because you can tell you're wearing blush, but it's not too harsh. So after I put on blush, I'm going to be using my bronzers in my NARS palette. And I like to mix these two colors together. So after I place it right here, I'm going to be placing it up around my forehead and around my widow's peak just to give my face a little more depth. I am a highlight addict. I love highlight. I overkill highlight. It's horrible. But I have a lot of highlight. Well, in my opinion, I have a lot. So one of the ones I use, and it's the only liquid highlight I have, it's the Cover FX Custom Enhancing Drops in shade Sunlight. So I keep the rest of my highlight in this NARS Z palette. I have five shades and I love highlight, so I use them all. I'm gonna go on a little rant about fan brushes because for the longest time, I did not like fan brushes because every time I tried to put highlight on them, they were just flimsy and thin and so it wouldn't really put on highlight until I found this Tarte fan brush, which puts on a lot of highlight because I ever kill highlight because I love highlight. But I really like this and I recommend this to everyone. So today I think I'm going to be using a highlighter palette. So I'm going to use the shade in the top left corner, which is a golden bronze color. So now that I put way too much highlight on, I'm going to finish off my whole look by using the Super Sizer by CoverGirl as my skin. I hope you guys like getting ready with me because I enjoy getting ready with you.